Hello, mementos. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, wherever you are. Uh, I'm Charlie, I'm head tinkerer of Momentus, and uh, I'm so excited for today's Instagram Live. I can't even tell you, as a Star Wars fan, as a fan of uh, the people you're about to meet, we have something very special in store for you. Um, I have uh, a mythosaur here in the background. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, and uh, I've memorized the creed. And uh, if you've been watching this season of um, The Mandalorian, then you're going to have uh, questions and you're going to want to talk to the people that I'm about to talk to. Um, you're, I can't wait. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. Hey, Sheldon. Uh, Sheldon created the incredible lithograph sold on shopstands.com. I was signed by Emily. It's an incredible art piece if you haven't seen it. Um, and we're just, we're just going to wait for Emily to jump in here and uh, have a little conversation because uh, tickets are on sale now and they end this Friday. So we want to make sure everybody knows what this event is about and that you get your tickets well in advance because they are selling out. Um, <laughs> people are already trolling in the comments. Excellent. Love to see it. Good to see that no one's let up on the trolling. Um, so we're going to talk today with two people that are instrumental in uh, the Mandalorian and Boba Fett sort of universe. Um, we've got, uh, well, we've got Emily Swallow, who plays the armorer. Uh, you might have seen her craft some chain mail for Grogu uh, and recently create a signet. Um, let's see. Okay, yeah, let me just make sure Emily has the instructions here. Full service here at Momentus. Uh, so they're about to jump on now. Um, anyway, so if you uh, have been watching The Mandalorian, you may have questions and theories and thoughts about the armor at this point, but you're also going to be meeting a man behind the scenes. Uh, his name is Tony Swatton of Sword and Stone. Um, Tony has nearly 30 years of experience creating arms and armor for TV and film, from the hook, from hook to swords and Pirates of the Caribbean and armor and so many different things. He can create a uh, realistic re uh, replication of some of your favorite swords and armor and, and knives. I mean, you name it, he can make it. So I, I was, I had the pleasure of going to Tony's uh, space in Burbank and everything in there uh, could kill me. Uh, pretty much every single machine, Chemical. I mean, he is a master at what he does, and I'm just really excited to. Okay, I think Emily's gonna jump in here now. Let's see. All right, All right she's joining now. Um, I'm just gonna keep singing praises while we wait for her. Um, there we go. So. Emily and Tony, Tony uh, mentored Emily. So we're going to talk to them a little bit about that process. And, you know, he's responsible for some interesting Beskar items. So you're going to want to find out uh, a lot more about this. And you'll find out a little bit about what we're going to do this weekend. And again, tickets are selling out. So if you're going to get your tickets, get them now before they're gone. And we're also going to talk about the charitable partner that is uh, a part of, of this event. Uh, let's see. There we go. Emily, you should be able to join now. Um, the charitable partner is something that's near and dear to my heart as well. Emily! Did it work? Yeah. There we are. Hiya. Hi. Hello. Tony. Hey, Charlie. How's it going, man? Good. We're uh, doing a bunch of hot, sweaty, sparky things. I can't, I cannot wait for this weekend. Ready? Wow. Yeah. Yep, yep, that thing can kill me. That thing's on fire. Great. We're going to have a good time this weekend. We're going to try to flip the camera here, and James is going to help us. Okay. Here. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. And uh, have her heat treat uh, quench the... Uh, we are going to get some heat. A little piece of uh, hot metal flaming up. So we're going to go over here. Do you, you guys... For giving a sneak preview of what we're going to do this weekend. Amazing. So Tony is responsible for a few items that you've seen in Mandalorian, and you can kind of see a few of the things they're doing. I'm going to quench it now. This is amazing looking. Woo! 
Too much away. Don't give too much away. Where you want this now? You notice I have gloves. Tony doesn't wear gloves. He doesn't. Tony. Yeah, but they, you know I'm not impervious. These are burns. These are not track marks. Those are also burn scars. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys want to talk a little bit about what we're doing this weekend? About what? Do you want to talk what are about we doing this weekend? Yeah. Can you tell everybody yeah. kind of what we're doing? Uh, Tony, can you get yeah, it? I'm gonna grab a couple of these. Okay. So, Tony, uh, because we don't have a whole lot of time actually live on camera this weekend, Tony has been slaving away to get to, he ha we have to fake some of it. So he's had to, like, put together things in various stages of the process so that we can show you what something that would actually take a number of hours in a matter of, like, 20 minutes. Like 20, 30 minutes, yeah. I think yeah. that's all we have. Yeah. So this is the initial laminate of uh, 25 layers of alternating steel and nickel that becomes our best arm um, credit mm -hmm. that in turn will fold in half to double the laminate level to 150 layers and then Emily will twist it, we'll forge out the spine on it, she'll grind it, we'll heat treat it as you just saw, Beautiful. and we'll immerse it in acid to bring out the cool pattern. Get a hey guys, I have a I have a friend here who wanted to say hi. Emily. She's somebody that wants to say hi. Okay. Oh wait, hold on. Hold on, I can't see the screen. Yeah, hold on. Okay. Oh my gosh, hi! Hi! How are you? Hi, whoever you are. <laughs> this is Tony. That's awesome. Just want to Say hey! Thank you so much for the action figures. You're amazing. They got they got the signed yeah, figures. The, uh, the armorer. I can't hear too well because of the planes that are roaring. <laughs> <It's really shocking. laughs> How often do you get to say that? Yeah, uh, Jen said that she got the figures you sent. Oh, good. I'm glad. Yeah. So, can you tell a little bit? about what we're going to do this weekend just to tease out what's happening uh we're going to make a 150 layer twisted um pattern welded billet um basically emulating the beskar uh credits and we're going to forge it into uh something that looks like the beskar spears that i uh, put together for emily's show for mandalorian and book of boba fett that's right, and you you help mentor Emily on how on how to do this process and become the armor in some way. Yeah, uh, um, last season I made a bunch more tools. I initially made the tools that she uses for the first two seasons. Uh, those were made out of titanium, and this current uh, season uh, she, you've been making armor for like Grogu, the little round Grogu, breast. Yeah. And uh, rondel. Yeah, the little rondel. So I made the tool that she could dome that and then planish over the top and put the beaded edge. And then there's some other tools for other things. Um, I don't know what's been revealed yet. <laughs> all you gotta be very quiet. It's yeah. all, it's all yeah. been, all of the- See, all other... of the blacksmithing sequences have happened. Okay, the they, show, they've yeah. all shared, been shown. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, yeah, I did things for shoulders and helmets. Yeah, we and... got to see both yes. um, mythosaur, yeah. shoulder pauldron. Yeah, I, I don't have a television, so I mean, <laughs> the only episode I saw was me forging the spearhead What's for up? Book of Boba Fett, and you know I saw Emily in that, so that was great. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> so these guys watch the show, and this is Tony. He's Hi, Tony. literally created Tony's weapons. Tony's a real blacksmith. Yeah. And he teaches me a few things so that I know what I'm doing before they say. But actually, we need it to look like this on camera, and then. <laughs> awesome. Saturday, Saturday, you're in for a treat because uh, I've wait. got grown men who have worked with uh, metal and construction tools their whole life who come in and just flinch, and uh, Emily kicked butt. No doubt. So, Biggie. Yeah. You. Yeah. 
Uh, I can't wait to come out and see. And by the way, Emily, uh, our boys are over the moon excited about their uh, swag. So thank you very much. My pleasure. You know, it's the least I can do. Elliot's on this Have fun. Super yeah, cool. Yeah, I can't wait to see. I, I, I didn't want to interrupt, but just want to come. Thanks for saying hi. Excited to see you. A few nights. All right. Amazing. Yeah, we got the finale yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. What? what? Um, what's that? I said we got the finale yeah, so tomorrow. The finale is tomorrow, and there's a lot of talk about your character, Emily. A lot of theories, right? We've been talking about this. What's happening with those theories Why are there, people, Emily? Why people so mean? People think I'm a spy, Tony. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, there's Jeez. like, be, after the last episode, there's all this stuff that, these coincidences that um, people think that the armor might be working for Moth Gideon, who is the main villain. Okay. Yeah. It's horrible because right. she's built up so much goodwill. Lander. She's a woman of integrity. Yeah. And people are so quick to believe. I refuse to believe the armor is a spy. Somebody just yeah. said, thank you. Yeah. yeah, there you go. All because she, she likes to have some horns on it her is. helmet. Right. I can add it's horns. a fashion choice. I can add horns to your uh, safety glasses for Saturday. Oh, my gosh. Oh, man. <laughs> This is, you guys, we're gonna have so much fun this weekend. I'm so excited. Yeah. Uh, tickets are selling out, so get them while you can. Go to bmoment.us. Uh, can you tell us a little bit also about the charity uh, partner for this event, uh, Emily? Yes, so Voices Against Cancer um, is a group that I've been working with for almost a year now. It's an incredible organization um, that funds pediatric cancer research, but also does such wonderful work to help the families of, um, of kids who are going through cancer treatment to make sure that they have um, financial support and emotional support because it is something that impacts the entire family. And I, I've gotten to know a lot of the families that are part of the organization and they're just such incredible people and they do have such a tight knit group and their, their outreach is so selfless and so generous and incredible. And it's been a real joy for me to get to uh, partner with them over this last year and um, and a lot of them are, are big Star Wars fans too so um, I'm excited that we're gonna raise a little money for them with this as well. Well we're excited for the event and to be able to support such an important charity I mean as a father of children also and, and having cancer in my family I appreciate the work that you're doing to help them um, it's in it's immeasurably important and we're just I'm so excited about as a Star Wars fan a lifelong Star Wars fan I can't wait to come out this weekend and shoot this for this virtual event. Um, and watch the season finale tomorrow. This is this is like all building. I can't, I'm on tenderhooks here. And then it's just done until mm -hmm. who knows how long. Yeah. We've been waiting for this season. You don't want to say anything season. about the finale right now? What'd you say? You can't say anything about the finale yet, right? I mean, it's gonna be really good. Okay. She can neither confirm nor deny anything. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's heard me say this enough. Right. Well, well, thank you. Thank you guys for taking some time out. You know, I know you guys are both busy. Emily, you're bouncing across the, the, the world, going to conventions and meeting fans. Uh, it's amazing work that you're doing. Uh, we can't wait to do this on Saturday. So please, everyone, get your tickets now. They are going to sell out. Certain aspects have already sold out. Um, and we're just going to have a blast. I can't wait to watch the process. Tony, you're such a master at this, and, and we are. And so Tony himself is getting ready. He's got a big premiere tomorrow that he's been building. You said you were building some armor for it? Yeah, I have. So I, he's uh, in the middle of stuff, and he's taking time out. Yeah, to... I mean, yeah, I wanted to get Emily up to speed instead of, you know, doing it on the fly on Saturday, and she's completely comfortable. She's a natural at this. I mean, she's a, a natural-born armorer. And uh, so uh, I think things will go well, you know. I didn't even pay him to say that. Well, <laughs> uh, it's, it, both, both of you are incredible humans, and, and we're lucky to be able to show everybody this, like, once-in-a-lifetime experience for every Star Wars fan and Mandalorian fan. It's, uh, I'm, tickets are, are selling, and time is running out, so please do get your tickets and help support Voices Against Cancer. Emily, Tony, thank you so much. Thank You're you, welcome. Charlie. Thanks, Charlie. Can't wait to see you this week again. Yep.